Hello and thank you for joining Dolphitech's topic of today, 7 Step Setup. We will be sharing 7 steps to optimize the start point for every inspection. Step 1, simply activate your transducer. With the Dolphicam 2 platform, the user can do this from the software or hardware. On the software, on the upper right side of the software platform, the user will use our shortcut key here to activate and pause the inspection process. When the icon is black, the inspection is paused. When the icon turns blue, the inspection is live. On the hardware, on the face of the transducer is a button. When the user compresses that button, the LED will turn green when the inspection has been paused, turn blue and blinking when the inspection is active. Step two, compress the color palette. This simply provides the user a better contrast on both the B-scan and C-scan. Step three, velocity. Select the appropriate velocity depending on the material that you are inspecting. Today we are inspecting a carbon fiber reinforced polymer. So we'll select CFRP. This assists with the appropriate measurements and scales on the instrument. Step four, delay. You wanna make sure that the interface echo or front wall echo is apparent on the display. You can simply do this by adjusting your delay. Now we can see the zero and our interface echo is more apparent on the B-scan. Step five, range. This part is only seven and a half millimeters thick. I do not need to have as much range as I currently do, so we will adjust our range. Zero offset. Step six, depending on where the software appears, the zero may appear directly on the actual interface itself. If it's not, then you can adjust it from here. By aligning the zero helps you with your measurements. Step seven, your gates. By adjusting your gating, this provides the information that you need to see in your C-scan. Please remember, you must adjust both gates in the time of flight mode and in amplitude mode. Once your gates have been adjusted, you can now go into your all view and start your inspection process. And those are the seven steps to optimization.